Hi, Mary with Reviewer's Diary. Welcome back to my channel. I am here with my finale for my 7 by Spring. And I will start out by saying I was not terribly successful. I don't really have any excuse for why. I just think I was concentrating on a lot of other things. So... I'm going to start first with the Dr. Brandt BB Cream. Now I had one that was in a blue tube and I had to toss it. It was all separated and it wouldn't work. So I sub subbed in another um, Dr. Brandt thing so I can use these things up. And basically this is too dark um, for this time of year. So I am retiring this until the summer. I only used it once or twice. There's no measurable change, and so I was not successful with that. I used these two lipsticks, uh, and it's really impossible for me to see. Oh, I think I see a line in this one. This one, judging by the light shining through, is up to here. So I did use quite a bit of that, I guess. This I know I used several times, but I cannot see where there's any like positive change. I just don't see it. This is These are included in my 100 pan also, or my makeup use it up, so they'll get used up. Um, they're very nice, they're not old, um, but again, I wasn't very successful, sadly. This item, now it was laying on its side, so it's hard to see, but it's down to about here. Now this is a sample size of Meet Matt Hughes don't like this stuff. It wears funny on your lips when it starts to wear off and it feels like it's a little bit drying so I'm I might not even finish this. I might give it to my daughter or you know just toss it. It's a sample and I really don't like it so why am I keeping it? So I did not use very much of this during this challenge. I used quite a bit of eye primer. You can see there's not much left. Just whatever is down here and there's quite a bit of air. I have to find this. Um, my CVS doesn't carry this right now. In fact, the Milani display, there is too much stuff for the small amount of space that they've allotted and they I haven't seen this in my CVS so I'll have to either either buy it online or find another store that has it. This is one of the very best eyeshadow primers. It costs $6.99, which is a lot less than a lot of these primers cost, and it's very nice. And I use a little bit sometimes under my eye as well, so I gotta find this. Uh, let me give myself a little credit. I did get a little further with that. I've worn this several times. I don't know where I'm at. It feels a lot lighter, but the brush isn't dried out yet, so um, it's not quite gone. I love this color, and I love the brush, and honestly, I'll be on the line to buy more of these Nika K eyeliners, because this is stunning, and Nika K is cruelty-free, so like can't get much better than that. So I do use this a lot of times on weekends, casual type stuff. I know that this is almost gone. It's just taking a little bit longer to show it. So I guess I could say I was successful with that. I also had this Lights, Camera, Lashes um, mascara. In fact, I counted two of them as one item. This one still has some juice. It's hard to tell how much because the brush comes out and it's not like loaded loaded but it's also not real dry so I know this is running out but I'm not sure how much longer I have. You know sometimes you think something's almost gone and it lasts like another three weeks so this might last a little bit longer so this will just go back into my everyday makeup drawer. Now the other mascara is gone hallelujah I have one item that's finished and that is this Estee Lauder sumptuous infinite this is a travel size that had 80 tons of product in it like I've never seen a mini mascara last as long as this did this lasted forever 
and I am going to really miss it because it's got a brush that's really unique. It's a plastic brush and it's, you can see that it, it looks more like a comb. And what I liked is it, this mascara put color on your lashes and separated them too. So I'm really sad to see this is really finally dried up and empty. So this will go into my empties barrel and from that empties video, it'll go into my makeup that's used up in the year 2016. I'm gonna be saving all that so at the end of the year I can go over what I have used up. And there's one other item, and I feel pretty good about this one just because it takes so long to use this product up, and that is the Smashbox Primer. There is only a little tiny bit down here. You can see I did squeeze all the air out. Um, and there's just a slight little tiny bit. Now, it does take forever to use this because you use slightly less than a half a pea size amount for your entire face. This is one of my favorite, absolute favorite primers. At some point, I want to get down to just Smashbox primers and um, Laura Geller primers because that's the other primer that's my absolute favorite. So this will definitely be gone um, soon, but it wasn't gone in time for this um, challenge. So where I was actually, I have to give myself a pat on the back because I was successful with some items, used up more than I thought I did, um, and just not terribly successful with the others, but that'll change and it'll get better and I'll be using this stuff up. In fact, I'm gonna put this back into my use up basket so that I can continue to use this and this and this <laughs> and this. <laughs> so these things are going to continue to be used up and you know eventually they will show up in empties videos and I'll be able to say yep I finished that I was successful Ooh, which is all anybody anyone can ask for. So that is it for my 7 by Spring. I currently also have a um, 5 by Cinco de Mayo, so you can look forward to watching that. And I'll have updates on my other um, 10 pan no, no buy that I just started, as well as my other um, challenges that I'm in, which is 100 pan and makeup use it up. So I have two other large scale challenges. I may pick up one small challenge after my 10 pan no buy is over. Then I might pick one up in um, June because that's when that ends. So uh, and if you're interested in collaborating let me know. I love to collaborate. It's a great thing to collaborate with somebody else. And that's it. Thank you for watching. This has been Mary with Reviewer's Diary with my seven by spring, some successes and some not so successful, but I still feel good overall. Thank you for watching. This has been Mary with Reviewer's Diary. Have a beautiful evening. Good night.